Rosie O'Donnell, who has for a long time been a staunch supporter of the Menendez brothers. Uh, she knows Eric and Lyle. She's spoken with them. I think she, in this clip, says that she's friends with um, the wives. With uh, the wives. So, uh, what does she think about the possibility of them actually being released? You know that the uh, that they're trying to decide whether or not the LA County DA. Yes, the LA County DA deciding whether or not. Basically, they the could either they could yeah. either re just flat out reduce the uh, okay. conviction to manslaughter, which would instantly free them uh, because they've served way more than the maximum, or try a, a new trial. They're not going to do a new trial because most of the right. people have died. It is that's not going to happen. So they're either going to be released or not. Released. Or not. Right. Uh, we got Rosie. Uh, Rosie was at LAX, and a photog asked her uh, about the possibility of her friends getting out. This is what she had to say. Listen, you were one of the first ones to defend the Menendez brothers. Yes, because they deserve grace and understanding, and they were abused children who had no other choice. They were 18 and 21, and there was judicial misconduct in the second trial where they would not allow them to use the defense of being sex abusers. Are you still in contact? I know Lyle sent you a letter. I talked to him on the way here. You did? Yes. How is he doing? How are they doing? They're excited. Are they hopeful? Very exciting news. They, they have the audacity of hope at this point. I mean, what do they want to do when they get out? I mean, there's- Same stuff they've been doing on the inside, helping other people. That's what they want to do when they get out? Yes.